Greetings, friends. And welcome back to Spyro 3. Yeah, I'm gonna get all of the gems and eggs in mm -hmm. this, uh, what is it, evening lake. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then the next couple episodes are gonna be short, too. We're gonna do, like, the Spyro level and the, um... Or the Sparks level. Yeah, yeah. The, the Spyro the level. Spark. <laughs> the gonna... Spyro level. <laughs> yeah, you know the one. Um, we're gonna do the Sparks level from the previous, uh, world, and, um... Mm -hmm. I forget the freaking Yeti's name. Yeah, um... I'm trying to remember. But we're gonna get him too. Yeah. Yeah, and then we'll be revisiting a couple levels. Eventually. <laughs> yeah, just gonna make a couple shorter ones so we can get back on track. Yeah, because we uh, started to fall behind with our little recording schedule and we don't have a lot of time these days. Yeah. Always busy. Mm -hmm. And, like, we've been talking about it in our own personal life for a while, but we might, like, eventually start cutting back, because we've been doing daily episodes since we started this channel, like, two and a half years ago, and, like, it is a hobby channel, so we don't really care too much, you know, we're yeah, just we're doing not... this to have fun, we're not, like, making money or anything yeah. off of this, and there isn't, like, a huge audience of people watching, it's just been something fun for us to do, and we'll be able to look back on it, and, you know, in the future. Mm hmm yeah, it's definitely something really cool. Mm -hmm. We've got so many episodes. <laughs> yeah, we do. It, it is really <laughs> wild. Like over 800 or something <laughs> crazy like that. But yeah, we just, uh, stupid. <laughs> we know that, um, you know, we won't always be living under the same roof and, or, you know, we won't have, like, the use of our hands or yeah. whatever. We won't, you know, they're just... There won't be a time in the future where we'll be able to do this, so we might as well do it now. We'll be old crack pots in a nursing yeah. home one day. <laughs> Give me my phone, I wanna watch my own YouTube content. <laughs> it's ultra mid. <laughs> uh, this is what I used to sound like. Before my voice was electronic. <laughs> I wish I could like do more like I, I don't know I feel like I can stress my voice a lot and do a lot more of different... my voice was electronic yeah like, <laughs> I was thinking immediately of a freaking scary movie yeah. 3 how <laughs> as we be Mr. President <laughs> oh my god <laughs> just start freaking out that shit used to crack me up I remember <laughs> that movie is hilarious the first three well actually the first four are all pretty funny <laughs> I never saw the fifth one yeah I haven't either I don't even know what movies they parody in that. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. Mm -hmm. hmm. They just, like, re-parody the same ones. Yeah. It's, like, the sequels. It's a remake of this Scary is a Movie parody of Saw 2. Yeah. <laughs> um, alright, I'm trying to remember where everything is. There's an egg up there. Also, this is the world that has one of those levels where if you skip the cutscene, it'll, like, fucking glitch the game out and you won't yeah. be able to get all of your gems. It's the fireworks factory. And I think we want to do... There's a... Oh, it's you. I'll free you next time. Or in, like, a couple episodes. I want to know his name. But I don't want freaking money bags to trip me up like last time. <laughs> and I just try and skip through his dialogue and end up activating the cutscene. Yeah, I, it's really bugging me that I can't remember his name. Bentley. Bentley's his Bentley. name. Yeah. I, w I was thinking it started with an A for some reason. I was like, Alistair. <laughs> the Yeti. Is it, um, Bowie? <laughs> um, alright, let me... Curvely. Curvely? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're just coming up with it like Ben. I got you. I was like, Bowie, Curly, what? Larry, Curly, no. <laughs> Arks, come back here if I eat her. Hannah Montana? <laughs> That's not you. Why do these eggs need us to hatch? Right? Just hatch on your own. Yeah, it's like we didn't even sit on you. Yeah, we're not like the parent or anything. Mm -hmm. We're not roosting. Yeah, we're not roosting. Spyro is not roosting at all. This will make you invincible. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Mm 
Yeah, honestly, I really enjoy gaming, but like I can see a day in the future where it's like my arthritis is too bad, I can't play for longer than like a short amount of time, or like I have to stick to like turn-based RPGs because they don't require you to like mash too much yeah. or like you know press a bunch of buttons really fast. You can take your time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they say um like playing video games for too long can like cause arthritis and like typing on your phone and like certain other activities but yeah. at the same time i'm not too sure because then like like um guitar playing for example there's um like famous guitarists that have been doing it for like such a long time like keith richards from the rolling stones for example he can still like play mm -hmm. like pretty good too and then like um peter frampton and um, Peter Frampton actually has um, this really rare type of arthritis that our dad actually has too, or um, they think he has. Anyways. Yeah, because they, they can't get like a straight diagnosis and there's so many like differing opinions. Yeah. yeah it's been annoying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but um, <clears throat> typing all day, I can definitely see doing yeah, that. Yeah, like, carpal you have to, tunnel You like all that flex stuff. your hand like flat and yeah. then you like barely move it, you know? And, and like just activating those muscles, I feel like uh, holding I remember when I was um, younger and like taking piano lessons, I used to like get the sensation after a while, like it felt like my veins in my hands were like rubbing on my tendons and it felt like really uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. But I don't get that sensation when my hands are like upside down for playing guitars or like other fretted instruments. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it is about that. Maybe it's like an ergonomic thing, because like my hands will hurt if I play video games for too long but also like i don't know they definitely hurt more from like typing a lot and like i'm i'm you know not doing that super often but back before we had smartphones you know if i was like if i wanted to go on facebook and talk to my friends and stuff i was typing and i remember like sometimes i'd be like in long conversations with friends and after a while like my hands are fucking cramping yeah. My hand used to cramp up like crazy from holding a pencil or a pen for too long. Yeah, that too. My hand will like start cramping. Also, I don't know why, but like when I write, I have this problem where I like drag the bottom of my hand like along the paper, and a lot of times like the entire side of like my it's pinky. covered in graphite. Yeah, yeah. mine does too. <laughs> I'm like, why yeah. does this happen? I'm like, is everyone else holding it like this, like yeah, with their I palm don't... off the paper? I'm like, cause I, I feel like I have to like drag my hand on the paper for balance. Yeah, me like, too. but if like if I use, you know, I also hold it with like you know two fingers and balance it against the third. Mm -hmm. it, I mean, like you guys can't fucking see it, but I'm showing yeah. Tom. But like, do people hold it like this? You think yeah. with like all three I've fingers seen and just like, hold it like press that and down like, like that? I couldn't imagine holding a pencil like that. I feel yeah. like it would just be really uncomfortable. I also have really like, big hands. I feel like so. my hands would be shaking all over the place. Like yeah. my handwriting is bad enough. I hate when I'm writing birthday cards with like my siblings, like for our cousin or like you know for any of our other relatives, like her and and like they'll have just written something and I go to write and I accidentally smear yeah. part of their message. I'm like, oh too. my God. I feel bad whenever Me too. I do that too. I'm like, damn. Yeah. yeah. A lot of times, like if I see that the ink is still like wet and fresh, I'll be like, <sighs> Me like too. I don't want to try to dry it off. I'll go line by line. I'll literally blow on the yeah. paper. But then I also I try to use pens that don't have super wet ink. Yeah, you know? me too. Yeah. A lot of pens are just like super watery or inky, whatever. Yeah. Like I don't know what formulation of ink they're using. Yeah, we but have... it's the wrong kind. <laughs> the wrong kind. We yeah, we have a ton of pens in our house that are just very inky. Mm -hmm. I don't know the ink spreads, but. Yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you'll join us next time. Bye-bye. Have a good one.